Hello, today we will talk about blood culture. What is blood culture? Blood culture test determines the presence of infection by bacteria and fungi in the blood. This type of infection can be life threatening and is known as septicemia. Why is this test done? If the patient shows signs and symptoms of septicemia, then this test may be asked for. The signs and symptoms of septicemia include high fever with rigors and chills, nausea, vomiting, shortness of breath, low blood pressure and confusion, coma, etc. As the skin of the patient might contaminate the blood sample, so specific precautions must be taken while collecting the blood sample of the patient. Is there any special instruction that is given before the test? For this test, it is very important that antibiotic should not have been started before taking a sample for this test. How are the results for blood culture interpreted? If the blood culture demonstrates growth of bacteria or fungi, immediately the treatment should be started. Sometimes after the growth of bacteria or fungi, a susceptibility test may be performed on blood culture so as to know about the best antibiotic which should be given to the patient. How much time can it take before a complete report is obtained? A complete report might take a few days because some of the bacteria grow slowly. However, usually a preliminary report is dispatched after one to two days and later on it is supplemented by a complete report. What other tests are required along with blood culture test? Along with blood culture test, a number of other investigations are required. Some of them are routine investigations like complete blood count, chest x-ray or urine complete examination. Certain specific examinations might also be required depending upon the signs and symptoms of the patient like peritoneal fluid analysis, pleural fluid analysis, sputum analysis, etc.